Good morning, good afternoon, good evening ladies and gentlemen. How are you? I hope you are feeling good and healthy. My name is Aurilla Frida Hayu. I'm a public relations student at Alistair Communication and Business Institute. Now I'm taking public speaking and presentation skills under the supervision of Mr. Charles Bonazaret as my mentor and lecturer. I'm here to discuss with you about Sustainable Development Goals and Breast Cancer. Sustainable Development Goals are SDGs also known as Global Goals. The United Nations approved the SDGs in September 2015. It's the 2030 agenda that aims to improve economic welfare, maintain a sustainable human social life, maintain environmental quality, and improve the quality of life from one generation to the next generation. SDGs have definitely goals, but I will focus on goal number three, good health and well-being. Goal three in action to ensuring healthy lives and promoting well-being for all of all ages. Now, let's discuss about breast cancer. Breast cancer is type of cancer that forms in the breast cells. Breast cancer occurs because cells in the breast grow up normally. Breast cancer occurs in the lobes of the milk duct or fatty tissue. In Indonesia, the most common cancer case in 2018 is breast cancer, with incident almost 70% and mortality 11%. The most common types of breast cancer are ductal carcinoma in situ, infective ductal carcinoma, inflammatory breast cancer, and metastatic breast cancer. First, let's discuss about ductal carcinoma in situ. The cell carcinoma in situ or DCAS is an early form or stage 0 breast cancer that can be prevented. DCAS starts to grow in the milk duct but has not spread from the breast area and has not invaded other breast tissue. And the second is invasive the cell carcinoma. It is the most common type of breast cancer. There are about 80% of breast cancer patients diagnosed with this type. IDC form in the lobos specifically in the pipes that carry milk from the lobus to the nipple. Next is inflammatory breast cancer. Inflammatory breast cancer is a rare type of breast cancer. It is very aggressive because it overgrows. IBC occurs because cancer cells block the limb channels or the lymphatic vessel covering the breast, causing the breast to swell like an infection or inflammation. And the last is metastatic breast cancer, which is known as stage 4 has spread to other parts of the body, such as the lungs, liver, and brain. Nearly 30% of women diagnosed with early stage breast cancer will develop metastatic breast cancer. Vaccine Indonesia is a non-profit organization in Indonesia, focuses on educating and spreading awareness about breast cancer and early detection through sadari or breast self-examination and sadari clinical breast examination. Loving Indonesia educates us on how to do breast self-examination or salary. Do this routinely every month. Check the breast once on the seventh day counted after the first day of menstruation. Step 1 is examine your breast with right arm. Step 2, use finger pads with massage oil. Step 3, do up and down wedges and circle movements. And the last step is examine the breast in front of the mirror for lumps or skin dimpling, change in skin texture, and nipple deformation. The treatment of breast cancer therapy depends on the location of cancer. It spreads the dependence of cancer cell growth on certain hormones. Surgery is preferred method of the treatment. In addition, there are therapeutic methods, chemotherapy, hormonal therapy, radiotherapy, therapy, and radiotherapy. First is surgery. Surgery is the first treatment of breast cancer. There are two types of surgeries in the breast cancer treatment. The first one is breast conserving surgery. It only removes the tumor in the breast area or lumpectomy. And the second is mastectomy. The surgery removes the whole breast. And the second is chemotherapy. Chemotherapy is the most widely known breast cancer treatment. This treatment uses an infusion or injection into a vein or intravenous and can be taken directly or oral to kill cancer cells that grow uncontrollably. If cancer cells have spread to the armpit area or the parts of the body, chemotherapy can be given to prevent stage 4. Chemotherapy is usually done before surgery to shrink the size of cancer. It is easier to remove cancer during surgery. The third is hormonal therapy. Hormonal therapy is the prevention of breast cancer when women have receptor against the hormones estrogen and progesterone. 
Hormonotherapy reduces hormone production that can help cancer cells or block hormones from sticking with cancer cells receptor. And the fourth is targeted therapy. Targeted therapy also known as biologic therapy. This therapy uses drugs to block the growth of cancer cells and it doesn't ruin the normal cells. If the breast cells found HER2 is positive, then targeted therapy is needed to block the growth of breast cancer cells. And the last is radiotherapy. Radiotherapy is prevention by damaging the DNA that divides cancer cells not to grow again. To kill cancer cells require high doses of X-rays and protons, but it can damage normal cells in the breast area. In conclusion, although breast cancer is terrible disease, we can prevent it through breast self-examination or surgery, and followed by clinical breast examination or surgery and routine breast cancer treatment. Treatment must be done to end breast cancer, but the most important thing is keeping the spirit, consuming healthy food, and not giving up easily. Let's survive together. That's all for what I'm saying today. Thank you for your attention. Please stay safe and stay healthy.